Hi, I'm Clay Kobernick. Many cybersecurity solutions and best practices exist for computing devices such as laptops, servers, phones, and storage appliances connected to your network. But what about the sensors, surveillance cameras, access control, lighting, and other IP to enable systems in your building? These also connect to your network and make it vulnerable to attacks from hackers, malware, and other advanced persistent threats. It's important to identify these points of entry into the network and follow the manufacturer's hardening guides for each device. Beyond that, there are many networking best practices that should be followed to make sure that your endpoint devices do not become vulnerabilities on your network. You may also want to consider using specialized security hardware such as deep packet inspection appliances and inline blocking tools to protect critical endpoints. These devices allow you to set traffic rules so that only appropriate communication flows through to your network. A solution like this is particularly important for devices that aren't in a secured environment or are considered mission critical. You should also be using a syslog manager to review your device's system log files on a regular basis. The data in these files reveal what normal operations on your network look like and can help you pinpoint flaws or changes in operations that could signal an attack. Additional tools to help thwart an attack would be intrusion detection software, change management, and vulnerability scanners. In the security and IoT space, many organizations are not currently utilizing their syslogs, and many endpoint devices don't currently allow access to syslogs. This shows that end users and manufacturers are still in the process of learning and establishing cybersecurity best practices for the new endpoint devices making their way onto the enterprise network. You can read more about this topic on Annexer.com and contact us to speak to an Annexer technology expert.